Okay, so this is Nerds Cubed. I'm Zip. I'm Slam Don. Slam. I'm RJ. RJ. And we have Doe over here who's just going to refuse to talk the entire time, but he's actually here. Tr trust me, we're not crazy. You have the same one as me. <laughs> great talk to start with. Like, My God. I know, right? It's like he's eating cheese and crackers and ham. I've got cheese and crackers and sausage. Can I have cheese and crackers? Oh, yes, you may. Yes, you can, aren't you? So. Well, I'm just sitting here playing Okami Den. What? On a DS Classic. The very first one. Yep. I think they're, they're, they're a little bulky, don't you think? Yeah, they're beasts, though. Yeah, but. They're like they're the N64. Like... You can throw it on a wall, it doesn't break. You can throw it off a fire store. Well, actually, no, that wouldn't work. <laughs> My friend had a water bottle that got run over by a truck. Mm -hmm. and it still works. Yeah. It, it's actually amazing. Like it's just crushing. It refuses to flat to make it cylindrical. Hmm. So this is getting recorded live on September twenty sixth, right? Is it the twenty sixth? Yep. Yes. And we're in our own room in the library right now. It's cool. So what's our first topic? Well we started off with food. Yeah, okay. What? Yeah, this is really just, just random stuff. Yeah, just random. Just talking. Daily lives of us. Yeah, basically. Can we, can we just start to talk about how, how we started this? Oh, the idea? Yeah. The idea behind it. So we're, we, we're just sitting outside the library at lunch, okay? And we're just talking. We started talking about Star Trek or something mm -hmm. like that. Just, just some random stuff. And then we decided, then after a while, we moved on to another topic. We said, hey, why don't you do something with this? It'll be a podcast. Cause it'll be funny. Because it's actually going to do something. Yeah. Just let me actually get something up and just... Go for it. So we're, just so we know what to do when we're bored. Yep. Yeah. Well, it'll be pretty funny to listen to. I guess these will be coming out like every Thursday. It depends. Depends on how long it takes to edit. Uh, so, I want to do that Star Trek conversation again. How does it go again? The, oh, red, yeah, the, the red shirts. shirts. <laughs> they always so, die. we're thinking like, if everybody in Star Trek died because they were wearing a red uniform, why don't why don't they just give the enemies red uniforms? Just like, here you go, wear these, and just yeah, do, and just have fun. Yeah, they'd always mm -hmm. die. Oh. Well, it would give all their enemies a nice sense of fashion. Oh yeah, so they die later. It's like every red shirt in the episode just dies. The one would just give them to the enemies. Yeah. If only, if only. Yep. I don't think I'm really a part of this conversation right now. Just yeah, you are. Maybe you should stop playing your DS. Yeah, I want to beat this game. I don't care, you can play that later. Pause it. So no, that's not pause it. You can <laughs> Close your DS and, and just it'll put it in a like there, it in sort of table. safe state. All right, anyway, I'll put it in sleep mode. Uh, sleep mode? Yeah. I think it's so bulky. Yeah, it's like oh yeah, it's like my <laughs> PSP as well. You look at those DS. Where's yours? The DS. Oh, it's the DS Lite. Uh, limited. It's like a Legend of Zelda limited. See edition. here, put them side by side. Yeah. Yeah, but mine's the tank though. Yeah, okay. yeah it's not not figurative, not not just the way it looks. It literally is a tank. Well, yeah. well screw you guys. I have a 3DS. Yeah, those well, things are. Screw you all. Nice. Screw you all. I've got a PSP. Yeah, I got a PSP two th uh, one thousand, and I also have a PSP two thousand, okay. which is just a. Okay, which one's the smallest? Yeah, so I'll put them. Which one do you guys think is the absolute thinnest, basically? Oh, thinnest. This one. Actually, probably, those, probably, these two, these probably the, the light. The the DS light. The DS light and like the PSP are about the same. So those DS. Yep. Yeah, but here's the thing. All I gotta do is open the thing, and it's about the same height. Uh, <laughs> That's the great thing about the first P the first thing. I don't exactly get the point of the DS. Well, it's just portable. Yeah, well, it's just a concept that they started with. Yeah, it was a concept that just got out of control. You think about it, they have like extra large now. What is the point of the XL? Well, my friend needs one larger screen. Yeah, but why? Yeah, I want my friend. For real well, it would help. Hard to see it. No. Yeah, actually, that's true. Well, my friend Chris. The, the, the only problem is so it's yeah. Hot, so it's yeah. The, the only oh. problem with the uh, DSi XL and the 3DS XL is that it's because the 3DS it, XL? yeah. Oh it, my god! Yeah. An extra extra large? <laughs> no. No, the 3DS XL. See there, he's real. He laughed. Joe laughed. Now you know he's real. <laughs> yeah, but the, the the only problem with the extra large DSs is, is that because the screens are so bigger, they're still the same resolution as the oh. other 
versions of, I would have of the DS. They, they, they upped the resolution. Yeah, no, it, it's the exact same, so everything looks more pixelated and stretched. Yeah. Yeah, it, like yeah, it's, yeah, it's just but like. Then, um, like a, but again, what is the point of having a larger DS? So, like, is there like nothing really special comes with it? It's right? just uh, mm-hmm. for it will help people who can't. Who have also, it's also for like smaller children because it makes it easier. Somewhere. Smaller children and a yeah. bigger. System. <laughs> why would you? Why would hey, you? Look, look at this. Look, no, guys, guys, it's for people with big hands. Big, yeah, okay. Actually, that would make more sense. And also for people who can't, but, who have harder times. But but, stuff. but why? Whose idea was it to put a bigger screen on a bigger DS? Uh, Nintendo's? I mean, it's like, <laughs> yeah, I've got, a, I've got a friend who's got a phone. It's made by Veo, or Vio, however you want to pronounce it. It's massive. It's like a very small tablet. It can't even fit in his pocket, and it's a phone. Yeah. Oh, it's like, a, it's like yeah. an iPhone. That's like the, uh, <laughs> oh, oh, what is it? The, the Galaxy Notebook. It's like... It's like it's humongous. Like a play it's like like a phone. You see my PSP case, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's like that, but square. And with the PSP in it. Yeah, basically, and it's massive. You can like go. Is that the PSP is portable? You can like go. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. You'll see him. You'll see him walking down the street talking on it. It's just this massive like. Is it new or old? Is it new? It's new. No, it's like uh. Oh my God! It's uh. It's actually nice. I mean, there's like that that one gaming device. I think it was the Nokia N Gage, where it acted also as a phone, but then. If you wanted to use it on phone, you gotta stick it sideways to your head. Uh-huh. So it would be oh. like it would be like doing this. So, yeah. That's a, but that's a neat concept, though, at least. It's yeah. a neat concept. Yeah, you look at the new uh, concept. You look at the new iPhone, okay? Uh, I know. Same thing. Every thing. single generation. They moved the same thing. They moved, they moved something. They moved the headphone jack and they just made the screen bigger. That's it. That's all they did. Yeah, they don't really... Do, in, the, in the operating system, it's pretty much exactly the same thing. What's, it what's gets updated the, every so often. Okay, what, what's this thing. about the, map, the new maps? iOS map 6 or something, the whatever. Map. Oh, um, yeah, the uh, the iPhone 5 does not come with Google Maps. Like, it is not Google Maps compatible. That makes absolutely no so sense. So they're using their own map system. No, I, I, I'm not sure about How that. How would they get the... Yeah, because the thing, they would have to get something. Yeah, they'd have the to get their own imagery, because they can't use Google's imagery. Because that would be copyright. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, Google will probably come out with an app for it eventually. Bit. Yeah, but they'd have to li- Apple would have to license it. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Buy it, buy it, buy the rights for it, allow them to use it. Yeah, which then that's a lot of paperwork and money. And blah, 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 blah. There's something else about the iPhone 5. You apparently you push a button and a physical strap comes out of it. Like a strap, like a wrist strap. No way. Yeah. No. Yeah, I You've read seen it. it. Really? Oh, oh, it's, no, it's, I read about it, but it was on IGN. I was like, what's the point? Also, have you seen the new They're Nanos? BSing you. Have you seen the new Nanos? No. They're like tiny little versions of the iPod Touch. Oh yeah, the new, oh, oh the yeah. iPod, oh like yeah. little square things, yeah. Oh, you've seen no, that? No, 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 the, they're rectangle. Oh, those ones? Yeah. Yeah, they actually make, okay, you know the little tiny shuffles? Those uh, make no sense. With the t- with the little touch screen on it, it makes no sense. Okay, imagine them. having like, something like 500 songs on a little shuffle. Imagine if you wanted one particular song. And it was like, had the shuffle it was the in the middle. Yeah. And it was in the middle of it, that would take forever. Yeah. Well, well, at least it. Well, it's a, the well the con. Well, the good thing about it is that it's tiny. It's like made for running. Like if you're gonna go jogging or something. Sort of what I guess they were trying to get out of it. Well, yeah, but I, it, it's more like you, you set up a playlist if you're on your computer or something. And yeah, like it's, but it's for your older you're brother. Your older brother. He put something like 300 songs on his tiny little oh, yeah. thing. Yeah, you remember that? Yeah, that makes How a lot of sense. How many yours? Like. 27. 27. Okay, see, there's a difference there. Yeah, I, like I, I, I don't yeah. have a lot of music. So, like, right now, my brother has my iPod Touch, because I never use it. You have a Touch? I had a Touch. Oh, I just, you had one. <laughs> you don't miss that guy. Yeah. He's not fat and happy anymore. You should be. Uh, now he's what skinny about and this, blowing sorry. shit up. That's true. Have you guys seen the new PS3 model? Oh, yeah, no. I did. No. Like, I mean... The, so they had the original PS3, and then they made the PS3 slim, the, the and now they made it just like just slim. super slim. Yeah, well, where it's like the PlayStation. Well, well, it's like the PlayStation 2 slim. Okay. Oh, like that, that one was Tony. Yes, I have that at home. Okay, so you guys know Sam, right? Yeah. Sam's got one that's like the size of a PS1. It's tiny, that thing. It is tiny. Yeah, I have a PS1 I mean, like, at home. Why would they redesign the PS3 again when it's already just to make it extra small? No, it's like, um... But I mean, the, the PS3 came out in 2007? Well, the thing is, I was reading this online, but, uh, 
Sony said they're going to be supporting the PS3, its hardware, its software, and everything until about 2014. Hmm. That's a long. That's a long. That long is console. a long time for a new console because if you think about it. How long did the N64 go? Oh yeah, the N64 went up to like 2000. When did the GameCube stop production? Um. That because that took a. That when, when the Wii, when did the Wii come out? Like 2006. It was still around with the Wii. Yeah, but when yeah, did they but actually like stop making? Shortly it? after the Wii was released, they stopped the game. Yeah, but if if you if you if you're, if you're noticing, there's it's like uh, the first generation. Yeah, you can get like uh, newer games for the PS2 now. Like Star Wars Force really? Unleashed, yeah, you can get that on the oh PS2. Oh my god, the PlayStation... You can get, um... For what, the PlayStation 2? Yeah, PS2. Oh my god. Hmm. They're really uh, nice, actually, because... But can you imagine that? Like, a, one of those high graphical games, Star Wars Force Unleashed. Doe, have you played that? Yeah, he's played it. Can you imagine that on the PS2? <laughs> he notices that, no. But, can you guys imagine that? That'd be interesting. It would well, just look really weird because of the resolution in that. But it, the, because the uh, PlayStation 2 is not made for that kind of stuff. Yeah. It's made for stuff from its generation. The PS2 in itself was a concept. Yeah, it was like... Real, I guess it was a bridge between the PlayStation 1 and the PlayStation 3. Uh, well, it's right. pretty much that's what it is. Well, unlike Nintendo World consoles, just oh consoles. No. the new Wii, the new no, Wii. the Wii U. Okay, now oh, I don't okay. get that. I don't get that thing at all. Well, so apparently, well, well, you've got a touch it's screen not control. It's, not it's, it's compatible. Though. But you can't buy the touch screen controllers at all. You get you get one with the system, but you can't buy them separately. You have to get the you have to get the system. You have to get another system. You get another controller. What? No. That's no in, in America. That's what's. In Japan, it's fine. In Japan, they'll be supplying it. You, you have but to order it then. But apparently, what you can do with the new Wii, you can turn off your TV and continue playing your game on the controller. Yeah. The controller yeah. screen. That's okay. Like, like that means you can have like someone then, watching TV then, and have someone. Then you'd have to have your system on, right? And how does it connect? Does it connect through through the internet or Bluetooth? What? How does it connect? Um, pretty sure it's Bluetooth. Yeah. Yeah, but if, you, if you're connected through Bluetooth, you couldn't really exactly use a mic all that well. Uh, some Bluetooth mics, some Bluetooth. Some Bluetooth mics are good, but that's because they're like probably studio quality or something yeah. like that. But those are expensive as <laughs> hell, and I don't think Nintendo will be doing that. Okay. Uh, what and the concept for it is actually really interesting, but only if they made it so it's cross compatible with the older Wii. The concept for the controller is it's interesting, but I don't exactly see it as really working. It's out. not going to work out the way I see it. This. There's a lot of problems that could go wrong with it. Yeah, they might lose quite a bit of money off of it. What do you think? Okay, he shrugs. <laughs> um, what about the Vita? The Vita? That's a, that's an interesting interesting concept I for really a new PSP. Like the, Vita. the Vita is what the PSP should have been when the PSP came out. At least they don't use discs anymore. They found out that cartridges are actually better yeah, in some ways. Like, and they actually made it so the information is not stored on the cartridge, it's actually stored on the PSP itself. I know, it's like... It's, it's actually really... It's what the PSP should have been. Not done. The, the only problem with that is that if you break your PS Vita or something, then all your data is lost. Yeah, but that's... What, yeah, but no, they no, have that's to put no, the the memory card. Memory six. Yeah. Oh, right. The memory, yeah, but the, here's the thing. That. The memory card is pretty much just a little tiny bit bigger. Um, micro SD card. I have yeah, a it's, yeah. it's a Magic Memory, Magic 8 Memory 2, M2. Yeah. That's what it is. I have a have one for my for my PSP. Yeah. 7 gigs, at least. It cost me like 30 bucks, which is great. No, I, I really like the concept of the Vita. Two touch screens, two cameras, two analog sticks. That's yeah. That's really what, the, I've said it again, but, was, but it's, it's what the PSP should have been. Yeah, the touchscreen thing would really bug me. <laughs> so I don't like having... Because on the back, because you normally hold it like this, right? Mm -hmm. like you could, there'll there'll, there'll, there'll the be something that you can switch. They're like this. No, there'll, there'll be something you can call... Some, there's probably settings within it that you can... Okay. Switch Another switch thing that. is, it didn't sell very well when it came out. Yeah, it's because... It's still not selling well. Selling yeah, because well. it's like a really... It's a different concept. I, I really think different. it's also because, like... There's not enough game support, like. Well, there's a lot. Very of few game, yeah, you can't. Yeah. It's there's actually a lot of good like, games coming out for it now. Like the PSP Go, the that was a very bad idea. Well, the PSP Go didn't. That was last. terrible that because um, it's not cross compatible with the older games. And, you and if you had them, them, if you had them, you had to go out and buy them again. Yeah, you had to buy just them again through the store. Through the store, which then you remember the whole PlayStation Network incident. Yes, that yes, was that's bad. The, that's, that was one thing, because if you buy it through the store, you better be using the prepaid cards. Yeah. So they don't get any of your credit card information. Credit card information. Telephone numbers. Oh, yeah. 
That's why you don't put your real in, real information. Never put your real identity into that stuff. Okay, well, let's, let's change your concept. What about video games? Any video games you guys are interested in this year? Black Mesa. Well, that one's already out. Yeah, yeah. It's, it, yeah well, it's nice, though. Something that's coming up. Um, coming up. Let's try that. Oh, crap. Uh, I haven't really been hearing much about any new games. You guys heard of The Last of Us? Yeah. Huh? By Naughty Dog. Yeah. Oh, that one looks really good. Like, I, I would like to see what it is about. Like, I, I know that it's zombie it's apocalypse. It's kind of zombie versus... It's not like we need another one of those games. Oh, no, no. This okay, is Resident Evil 6. That's a game I'm looking forward Resident to. Resident Evil 6. Yes. The fifth one was not great. Yeah, but at least... But they're bringing back zombies, though. Were they always zombies in Resident Evil? No. Resident Evil, Resident Evil 5 were not zombies. They were infected people. Like, they actually had... Infected paras- people. Is it still <laughs> Parasites. Affected by parasites. Is that still zombies? No, it's, it's still classified as zombies. <laughs> no, yeah, but it's a parasite. That's See, no, you taking, said yes. It's a parasite. No, it's a parasite that's I'm, taking control. Of it's I not a virus. I think it's zombies. Yeah, when you blow off their head, they're not dead. The virus actually comes. Like, <laughs> not the virus. Parasite comes out. <laughs> yeah, I had a person following me for like 50 minutes, like 10 minutes. All right, what about? Going to die. Yeah, like, uh, also, like, for the Wii U, I know that it's not out yet, but it's, like, coming out in November, yeah. I think, so... Assassin's Creed gonna 3 is going to be going on to it, and yeah. I, I'm curious to see how that's going to work. Yeah, uh, but I, I think it's... Uh, I'm looking for more of, like, the Nintendo franchises, like, what they can do oh, they're, on they're, the Wii U. they're going under. All the Nintendo franchises, they're just going under. Like, I, I would really want to see what Last they can do with Legend of Zelda yeah. on the Wii U. Let's, well, that, w- that would be... <laughs> that would be actually... Like the last Legend of Zelda game, the Skyward Sword was actually a, was actually quite good. Yeah. They did yeah. a good job with. They changed something. You can ex- you actually have to use items. Yeah. That you got in the past. Unlike all the other ones, they sort of broke that habit finally. Yeah. Where you only use that item in that dungeon, and that's it. Except your bow, you know, in Ocarina of Time with Ganondorf, and you just use. But yeah. the one item that you still use throughout the entire game is your sword. That's the only item that oh, was in it before. You, you kind of need that. Yeah, and your shield, and that's really about it. Those are the only two items that you use throughout the entire game. That Actually, I, I never used my shield in that I don't, game. Uh, no time you have shield to. In no time you have to. Yeah, you have yeah. to. Yeah, because it's required for certain things. I didn't really get into the Zelda franchise, because I've never really been a Nintendo gamer. Mm-hmm. I'm also a PC or Sony. Yeah, I like the well. The well, I still think one of the best consoles was the N64. Yeah. It was a really great console. They had so many different things, so many new thing, new ideas come out. Yeah. Well, and another like great uh, console specific franchise was uh, Spyro the Dragon on the Spyro, PS1. Spyro, yes. yes. Oh, Spyro. Oh, Sony. Games are Sony? Oh, the new ones suck. They're yeah, really I mean, like, franchise. Like, the, the, the PlayStation three. One. The, the, the PlayStation first three ones. done by Insomniac on the PlayStation One were Is amazing. Insomniac? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Insomniac games. Wow. They they did the first three Spyro games. Yeah, they also did Ratchet and Clank and uh, yeah. uh, Resistance. Yeah, right, yeah. Continue. Yeah, Spyro's and, uh, still a really good series. The first well, two. No, but the I mean like, because uh, when when Insomniac was moving over to the PlayStation Two, they ended up uh, letting go of Spyro. So I was kind of disappointed by that, like. Because, like, I mean, then, then you, yeah. you look at, uh, what was it, Enter the Dragonfly, which is the, ga- which is the game released by Activision, like, as a sequel to Spyro Year of the oh, Dragon. Oh, Act- I think Activision nowadays is just garbage. Yeah, I mean... And there's Capcom. Capcom, oh, Capcom. Capcom was good when they listened to people. Oh, Capcom is just gone. It's gone now. It's just gone. It's but, just... But, I mean, like, with, with Spyro, Enter the Dragonfly, like, the, the first three Spyro games had set a very high bar, and yeah. then... When they released Enter the Dragonfly, it was Lower unfinished, yeah, low quality, yeah, and like I mean, yeah, I've tried, yeah, I've tried it, it's just garbage. Yeah, yeah the last, true. yeah, the last game I think Capcom, like a good game that they came out with, yep. was you know the Okami series. Well, no, <laughs> <laughs> well, it's not a really known game. It started out on the PlayStation Two originally. Never heard. Of then it. it was put it over to the Wii. Never heard of it. Well, no, look I've, it up. I've heard of it, but I I've got Okami down right here. Though? Yeah, he's heard of it. Yeah, the game I have here oh, is here Okami Den. Oh, here comes the DS. Okami Den, uh, which is I still, which is I, which is the game I think is the best that they came out with. That has anybody, has come has out has anybody with. played Patapon on PSP? Yes, I have. Uh, I have Patapon, Patapon and Patapon Two. Oh, Patapon, Patapon, Patapon Two is a lot. There's second one. There's three of them. Patapon, three of them. Patapon, Patapon Two, and Patapon Multiplayer. Oh, Patapon! I love you, Patapon. I love it. I just need to get. I have it. Yeah. I got it for um. I got it from the 
like I didn't have the disc for it, like when I bought it. Oh. it well, that's so. <laughs> it's a crunch, crunch, crunch. When I bought it, I didn't get it through. I didn't get it as a disc. Yeah. It didn't come as a disc. I got it as a. Oh, the digital. Digital. Okay. And unfortunately, my PSP is hacked. So. Yeah. I still, but so if I do, well, so I need to get the ISO for it. Okay. But I do still technically on, but I still do on the game. Yeah. I put money into it. What about so I'm not letting it down. You tried Loco Roco? Loco Roco, I tried it. It's really weird. I, I, <laughs> it's a I different it game. Weird. I it, it's weird. It's a really, fun. it's a weird game. It is a weird game. Okay, it's okay. What about, uh, anybody, any of you guys seen any of the new Doctor Who episodes? Uh, not really, I haven't. They don't have, obviously, they obviously have. They do. I haven't been watching, I don't, I haven't been watching very much TV I've, recently, so... I've been watching so them lately. I have, I've actually I've never seen, seen Doctor Who. What? 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 RJ! Watch the last season! Series 5, 6, and 7 with Matt Smith, I like those ones the best. Yeah, I like that one. Matt Smith, I think, just, he, he portrays no, not, Doctor not the new, not the new, not the new one, like, not the new one, or the... No, Matt Smith is the current doctor right now. Uh, I, think I like the other one. The other one actually... Tennant? Yeah. No, I, like, was pretty, I liked him. Who did you like more, though? Tennant? Okay, he liked Yeah, him. I liked him because he actually looked nuts. Yeah, he they, looked really insane, just Matt the way Smith, he looked. Matt Smith, is, he's, he's, he acts more of an alien than Tennant ever did. If you think about it. Tennant was a little more down to earth. Well, Matt Smith was yeah. like, oh, this is all new to me. Yeah, because it is. Yeah. He, is, he just got reincarnated. Yeah. That's the thing. It is obviously new to him. Oh, I still think... Oh, no, that's what's still, still my favorite. I still like the last... Season. Tenant? Yeah. It's same like too. Yeah. And because it, that that's... And also I started with him, and then after that, it's like... I don't really like the new one very much. I might... Uh, if I start watching some more, I might start get to... Uh, start my liking him. Yeah. I start to like him, but... Currently, right now, uh, as I stand, I don't really like him very much. Mm. Yeah, but I liked how it's just a low-budget show that's been going on since, like, the 60s. Wait, 1963, was it? Since some, somewhere in the 60s. I think it was 60s. 50s? What, what was it, though? 63? 60s, yeah. like... It's oh, he talked. he talked! He talked! He talked! Again, I hope... <laughs> I, I hope this camera picked that up. I hope it did, too. He talked. Yeah, but... Wow, uh, first episode. He talked. Yeah, my dad... My dad used to watch the... Watch it a lot when he was a kid. Yeah. Like, that's how old it is. And it's a low-budget show. It's, it's, it's been going on for so long. It's well, just, no, 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 no. It, it's, when, when did it stop? It stopped at some point. But then it picked up again. It picked up. Yeah, but it's still been going on for quite a while. Oh. 2005 started, ended 1987. When did it? Was it? Maybe. Yeah, they had a bit of a break, but still, it's still going on, though. But it's still, it, for a low-budget show, it's been going on for so really good. quite a but look at the time that when it started, and then when it ended, then when it picked up. Just like get rid of the time in between that. It's been going on for quite a while. For longer than most shows. Why did it break again? For what? Probably some budget issues, maybe. Which would make maybe. sense. But the why for so long? I think maybe BBC was having tr yeah. troubles with fires and stuff. And the oh, and oh right, down. because there, it was something with their anti- uh, pol it was something with the policy. And they oh, lost like six the episodes. Right? No, they lost six episodes of Doctor Who because they weren't uh, uh, archived. Ah. The six of them, but it's just gone. Nobody knows. No, nobody knows about them. They were filmed. Nobody sees them. But they're still there, but they probably can't go on. No, they're gone. No, they're completely gone. Like they were destroyed. Oh. Yeah. Burnt up. Because oh, yeah, it was, they, were, they weren't archived. Oh. I mean, they were probably on TV, but that's it. Well, what has been your favorite episode in the past series? I like some of the movies, some of them are pretty fun. The Power of Three and the Town Called Mercy have thought. Those are pretty good. I like those. Uh, you guys excited for the Saturdays episode? Don't blink. <laughs> Don't blink. Okay. Uh, well. yeah, like, RJ's probably here. feeling left out over here. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. I, I always feel left out. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, no, you, you just burn yourself sort of right there. A little bit. Okay, what, what does RJ want to talk about? Hmm. <laughs> RJ feels hungry. RJ wants to play Maple Story. No. Maple Story? Yes, I want to play Maple Story. Ice? You remember when we played Maple Story? I played Maple Story no. at one point. We all, I think everybody's played it, at least once. It just life. takes... Okay, RuneScape. Everybody's played that. Oh, no. Don't even bring, bring that up. Don't bring that up. Everybody has. Oh, no. I know you probably have. Yes, he has. 
Oh. I, I no, remember, no, 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 it's pretty sure. I, I remember, remember I had Zip and Go as... Oh. They made an HD version. It doesn't change remember, anything. It's still pretty crappy. I played before there was a membership. Before you had to pay to, like, kind of get... get to get, get the good stuff? Yeah, get... I thought that, that... That's probably what brought it down quite a bit. Like, oh, that, that's what a lot of games... I'm cool. surprised it's still going. Okay, one game that I found is... Well, a lot of people still pay. There's, like, over 200 million accounts created. Yeah, but... Yeah, but are they still... But are they all being used? Probably not. Yeah, that's the thing. Um, one game I think has been pretty successful with the pay, with that type of paying system. Yeah. It's been World of Tanks. Oh, pay the, that, yeah. That, that, that actually worked out well because you don't need to pay in order to actually do well. It's like it's Battle Pit. All, all, it all it helps with is just getting just that little bit more experience. It's like Battle Pit play for free. Yeah. It just helps you get a little bit more money and a little bit more experience. That's it. A little bit. It's better than play, it, pay for win. Pay to win, right? Yeah. That kind of system. What about, actually, I, was, I had something. What about... Um, Roblox. Roblox? Uh, <laughs> that was, uh, yeah, we all, we all had it. Was good, it was good at one point, but then it sort Before of... Before Builders Club. Yeah, and then it sort of went, yeah. Hey. Oh, we had a lot of fun with that. Yeah. Uh, I found that, like, Roblox is only fun for a while, but then it, like... Yeah, then... It, like... Then it's just gone. Because all, all there is to do in this game is created by users. Yeah. And it, no, none of it's actually really like it's. I guess it, what you're trying to get is that. Yeah, I mean, like some of the stuff's good. Some of the stuff. All, 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 all the stuff like, that you can do you is compare it to by Minecraft. Users. You can compare it to Minecraft. Yeah, it's Minecraft's like, better than that. Minecraft is better than. It's, got, it's got a lot more. Um, like you can do a hell of a lot more. Well, Minecraft, Minecraft is just amazing in that way. Yeah, I, yeah. Well, one of my favorite mods part is bread power, yeah, because it makes all the circuitry. Yeah. So much easier. Tech it. Sorry, had to. Technic. Tech it. Yeah, uh, just like that. For that sole reason, like, you can uh, easily make a blast door. Anyways, I think we'll have to continue this next week because we're running out of time. Uh, the bell what time is it? Minutes, 12.42. Ah, uh, the yeah, bell so likes to be there. It can so be earlier than it should. Let's all sign off then. I'm Zip. I'm RJ. I'm Sam. And Doe's over there playing with his pocket watch. He talks, like, twice in this episode. We'll see if we can get him to talk more. This yeah. has been Nerds Cubed. So... See you guys next week. Yes. Have a good week. Bye, Bye guys.